in February, I got a few shirts and a package of fabric paint. I wanted to paint something, but I didn't know what. Fast forward to sometime near Thanksgiving, I had just the thing I wanted to paint onto a shirt. Cause zoom in! I started off drawing him on a thick piece of cardstock to make a stencil, but then I realized it wouldn't it would be hard to cut the little details out. Because of that, I decided I would make a plan digitally and just freestyle the rest, with basic shapes drawn in chalk to make sure everything's placed correctly. At first, I wasn't planning on coloring in some of the sections, but later I realized it would look messier without solid blocks of color. Cough. And I was spacing out and colored in the red part of his hair, and decided to man up and stick with it.
I didn't fully know what I wanted to do with the leaves. My digital plan had them included, but it wasn't giving me the right vibes. Nonetheless, I went with the digital plan since I didn't think of anything better. Turns out, sparkly green paint makes the design a whole lot better, so I didn't regret at all. Ha <laughs> ha! Then came the black box. Woo! Boy, that was a test of my patience and my hand steadiness. At moments like these, it really feels like my hands can't stay stable. It's like they sense I'm about to do something important and they want to exact revenge on me. Besides that, I think the lines turned out quite nicely. If not better than, if not better, because of the slight shakiness. Painting this shirt has spent a whole lot of my luck and motivation for painting. Good thing I did this... How many months ago? November, December... So like, two months ago. Because I have a lot I want to draw right now.